hey guys so welcome or welcome back to my channel my name is tyra and for today's plant video we're just going to be doing some plant chores some um long-awaited plant chores actually um i've kind of been a little neglectful of my collection i just bring you guys along with me pretty much i don't know what i'm gonna title this video <laughs> but we're just gonna see what happens so yeah if you like plant type of content definitely consider subscribing down below be sure to leave a like and a comment and yeah let's go ahead and get started okay so for today's plant tours video i think i'm going to be experimenting with leka so here i have pretty in green that's the brand name this is their beginner leka kit i got off of their website i'll leave the link down below to everything mentioned in this video so yeah, I think I'm going to go ahead and put my baby Thai constellation into Lekka. So this is very exciting. And I also want to go ahead and put this Hoya stem in Lekka as well and my painted lady. So yeah. Okay, you guys. So a video I watched it's five tips for Lekka, basic tips for Lekka 101 on the Pretty in Green channel. He gave me a good tip to clean the Lekka really fast. I know a lot of people say to let the Lekka soak for like 24 to like 48 hours or something or more. And I don't have that type of time. I'm impatient, okay? <laughs> I feel like, oh, sorry, you guys. Let me hold my arm up. I feel like if there's a faster way to do something and you're going to get the same results why not do it the fast way anyways so yeah we're gonna put this lekka it's a one pound bag of lekka in a bowl with some water and microwave it for two minutes so yeah let's go ahead and get this lekka clean and get these plants potted up you guys i'm so excited <laughs> Okay, you guys, so I have my freshly sterilized Lekka here, and I've also ordered some self-watering type pots on Amazon and also some um, multiple sizes of, like, net pots, I think. You, you guys will see what I'm talking about in a second. Okay, so they oh, okay. <laughs> so they look like this, like how stinking cute, and I thought it would be the perfect size for my my baby plants right now. You guys, please like excuse the lighting if it's terrible. Um, but yeah, I have a three pack of these, and they're all the same size. Let's see. Oh, okay. These are interesting. This is not how I thought it was going to come out. Of uh, Ace, watch out. Okay, so I have three different sizes of these slotted, like orchid pots. So yeah, I was thinking maybe using these smaller ones in place of the white bottom so I can kind of have a clear base and kind of see like that how the roots are doing, keep a, keep a better eye on the roots. So what do you guys think? I think I'm going to use these pots. I like how it looks. Alright, yeah, let's go ahead and get started. So, hey, I don't know why I'm, <laughs> this is literally my only cutting of this painted lady and it has the shortest little node at nodal area i don't know why i'm experimenting with this right now but something is just telling me to just do it so i'm gonna do it 
Next, let's see, where is my Hoya cutting? Come here. Look, you guys. Look at my Hoya is pushing off a new branch. These roots are crazy. This is so exciting. my three plants in Lekka. Here is my Thai constellation, you guys. We're taking the training wheels off. No more cup with the perlite. I've gone ahead and transferred this into Lekka and we're just gonna cross our fingers. <laughs> we're gonna cross our fingers. Again, here's the newest leaf. Gorgeous, of course. Here we have my Painted lady, painted lady, excuse me, cutting right here. I'm having high hopes for her. I really do have high hopes for her. I think she's going to be fine. And here we have my Hoya Carnosa cutting. I think this is going to be fine as well. So I'm going to go ahead and get this nutrient solution mixed. And yeah, we're going to go ahead and fill these up and wrap this video up. Mm -hmm. 